three, two, one, go. 24, 48, 72, 96, 120, 144, 168, 192, 216, 240. 2015, I broke a couple of records which were once held by uh, math maestros like Scott Flansburg and Shakuntala Devi. N. Bhanu Prakash, 20-year-old math wizard from Hyderabad, became the fastest human calculator in the world after winning gold for India in the Mental Calculation World Championship at Mind Sports Olympiad in London. When I took part in the Mind Sports Olympiad Mental Calculation World Championship, I knew that I was going to get back a good medal, that was for sure. But I mean, to win a gold medal for the country with a 65 point difference, which is I think almost around 60% percent difference from the second place, is I think a really, really good feat and something which I'll cherish for a long time. Apart from winning medals for the country and breaking world records, Bhanu Prakash, with his startup Exploring Infinities, is working towards a greater goal. While competitions are a really important and a really good place in which I would want to identify myself, yes, I will go defend my crown, yes, I will go defend and get back more goals for the country in the other places, break more world records. My target on the other side is to look and be the front-running ambassador who sort of talks about maths and the importance of this particular subject um, in terms of not only its application in science technology, but also as a as an internally uh, as as a way in which you explore your your brain capabilities, and 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 that promoting that in a country like India, where three out of every four children are math phobic, even today, and um, because with my firm exploring infinities, that's what we've been trying to do. We've been um, projecting and working with the governments as of now to a certain capacity, but. I think the next goal is to upscale this and hit and um, impact more than 10 million or 11, uh, I mean, a crore people uh, in, in changing the way in which they learn math. Because I think I'm in that place with to actually tell people that this is a subject which can be fun. I mean, I did make it fun in my own ways. You can do that too. And let's learn math the, the more fun way. So yeah, I think that should be the bigger goal right now. Bhanu wants to eradicate math phobia. For this, he wants to change the way math is thought. But is it possible with the new education policy 2020? Absolutely. So the new education policy sort of gives the leverage to um, to tweak and play around say, the subjects which have been rigid for a long time. So, um, I mean, if, if I broadly tell you that three out of, as I mentioned, right, 75% of the people are math phobic, that's because um, you develop this phobia as a kid because you you're asked to do big calculations, you're asked to do things, and and mathematicians and and, and let's say teachers grade you extremely horrible scores for for doing uh, relatively small mistakes. So I mean, if I broadly have to look at it this way, I have four bags. If, if, if a question says I have four bags of oranges, each bag has a hundred oranges in them. Um, there are two uh, two aspects to this. A mathematician looks at 100 into 4 and then the capacity to eventually multiply it. Although um, mathematicians and, and, and teachers and the education policy as of now has been driven only towards the result, which is, is if the answer is 400, I'll give you marks. Otherwise, I won't. And that rigidity is going to change. And maybe, maybe the education policy right now is the first step towards bringing back the old Indian math glory because we were, I mean, India was a powerhouse of mathematicians back in the day. And yes, there has been a good, decent gap in the middle, but I think that will be and bound is bound to be bridged. To be the best in the world is great and powerful thing. And as we know, with great power comes great responsibility. The fastest human calculator title tells that you have been quicker than anyone else in a certain kind of calculations, whoever was or whoever is right now. So, I mean, it's not only just the present question, but it's also about a historical context, saying that you were the best than anyone ever was, which which is a huge responsibility by itself. I mean, responsibility-wise, to be, to be the front-runner of India's uh, vision math pro project. So, I mean, until now, we always have been talking about literacy levels. We have been talking about how literate our country, how literate our state is. Literacy and numeracy are the two pillars for child cognition and child development. I mean, for the generation to come, these are the two pillars which will make or break India's uh, position in the global learning curves. Literacy give a lot of importance to. 
how many of us are scared of language no one is because we are good with some language or the other how many people are scared of math almost everyone so the numeracy as as a project which has to be built is something which i am pushing for talking to the governments for it and i think my my take away from this would be to request and put since considering that the india india as a country right now is doing exceptional work in in reforming education emphasis on numeracy emphasis on bringing back the old indian math glory can translate into bigger context and let me tell you it's not just to be able to do good math but it's about how much can this impact let's say our our gdps uh, how much can this impact our composition of 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 work and global representation so yeah i mean as the title the world's fastest human calculator being from india i think i have to front run this campaign and moment because i mean i'm at a position where people will listen and yes i think that's the reason why i should use my entirety for it well now after all the talking let's see some action okay that should be quite simple the answer is 1549 4,93,824. world record which i hold which was once held by scott flansburg and shakuntala devi before that i mean um, was what was what, what i stole was is to take a two digit number and keep adding it to itself as quickly as possible and speak out the answers so um this will actually show you how quick the brain can function because all the intermediate results are coming outside it's not just like a final answer but you you're going to see what that is and probably people can look and race against this with a calculator in fact that's the record all about like let's say a human with a calculator and me there's a contest which goes on so if you can give me a random two digit number i think we can go we can go give it a try 3 2 1 go 24 48 72 96 120 144 168 192 216 240 264 288 312 336 360 384 yeah, I mean, this is one of the records which I hold of doing this as quickly as possible in 15 seconds. And yeah, the world record is to do it for 41 times. Bhanu has four world records and 50 Limca book of records to his credit. Some of his world records, as we know, includes fastest human calculator, power multiplication record and super subtraction record. With people like Bhanu Prakash and his work towards the greater cause, India will soon break more world records.